how any company, a retailer in particular, uses social media has become a huge issue. Especially, I've seen data saying that when people go to a site from a Facebook page, they're twice as likely to buy something right. as if they go through some other way. Uh, how is there a way? Is there a way to use this to build sales? Absolutely, and uh, you know we're we're obviously looking at the interaction between Facebook and our social media strategy. And Facebook's been an amazing partner for us. Um, and how that ties into our e-commerce, which is one way that we can sort of trigger sales. But as are really more important for us is how do we use that to build communities, even local communities, around our stores. I mean, we, we're a retailer that is very committed to our stores, our bricks and mortar. And how do we make that, uh, use the uh, commitment that we have for communities, how do we reflect that in how we interact with people on Facebook and in social media? And how does that translate into a, doing a better job at the store level? And I saw that you have just launched 3,500 Facebook pages right. for in, each for an individual store. Right, absolutely. And that is really based on this commitment to local communities. You know, it's a, a little cliche, but people talk about retailer, retailing being fundamentally a local business. And that's because as a customer, what you experience is your Walmart and the other retailers that you have a choice um, to choose between. There, there may not be a Walmart in your town, and if there isn't, we're probably not in the consideration set. And so how do we interact at a local community level is really important to us, and that's why we've launched these local Facebook pages. And our goal is to actually really integrate into the things that are happening in a local community and to make us better merchants, quite frankly, through that and do just a better job serving people.